Hello, I'm Chief Pat Turner. In this video, we'll talk about dry barrel versus wet barrel hydrants. But before we dive into it, if you're interested in this type of information, hit that subscribe button for me and ring the bell for notifications when I post new videos. And of course, don't forget to like this video. This helps us get more visitors. Thank you. Dry and wet barrel fire hydrants are two common types of hydrants used for water distribution in firefighting and other emergency situations. The key difference between them lies in how they're constructed and operate, particularly in regions with colder climates where freezing is a concern. Dry barrel hydrants are designed to prevent the water in the hydrant from freezing during cold weather. They're commonly used in areas where temperatures drop below freezing as they help avoid damage caused by expansion of freezing water within the hydrant. In dry barrel hydrants, the main valve is located underground and is connected to the water supply. When the hydrant is not in use, the main valve remains closed and the water drains out of the hydrant above ground. This prevents water from collecting and freezing within the hydrant, reducing the risk of damage. Wet barrel hydrants are more commonly used in areas with milder climates, where freezing is less a concern. In wet barrel hydrants, water is constantly present within the barrel and stem, allowing for quicker activation when needed. When the hydrant is open, the water flows immediately as there is no need to drain or clear any frozen water. This design makes wet barrel hydrants suitable for areas where the risk of freezing is low. The choice between dry barrel and wet barrel hydrants depends on the local climate and the potential for freezing. Dry barrel hydrants are favored in colder regions where freezing water could damage hydrants and hinder their functionality. On the other hand, wet barrel hydrants are more common in areas where freezing temperatures are rare. In conclusion, the primary distinction between dry barrel and wet barrel fire hydrants lies in how they are designed to manage water within the hydrant during cold weather. Dry barrel hydrants prevent freezing by allowing water to drain when not in use, while wet barrel hydrants keep water continuously present for immediate use. The choice of hydrant type depends on the climate and freezing conditions of the area in which they're installed. Well, that's it for now. I invite you to check out my website at chiefsclassroom.org for an in-depth approach to entry-level firefighter testing. Each of my courses is designed to complement the other courses, and together they direct the student in how to approach the exam process. I look forward to seeing you in one of my courses. Take care.